Problem 22. Rectangle DEFA below is a 3 by 4 rectangle with DC is equal to CB is equal to BA is equal to 1. So this is 1, this is 1, this is 1. The area of the bat wing shaded area is what area? Well, we have a rectangle here. It's a 3 by 4, so that means this is 4. So there's two ways to approach it, right? The first way to approach it is to get the entire rectangle area subtracted by the various triangle areas. So I'm going to go about this route because I feel like it's going to be much easier. It's much difficult to get this shape just by, you know, using standard base times height divided by two formulas. It's much easier to just go about doing, um, subtracting the areas of the white triangles you see here. So let's first address these two triangles. Um, I'll call this A1, I'll call this A2. The A1 is equal to A2, right? So what is A1 area? Well, this is a right angle, so therefore this is 4. So what is the area of A1? Well, that's base of 1 times the height of 4 divided by 2. To give two since we have two of them we have a total area of four so right now we have the rectangle area minus four plus this area a3 and this area a4 now a3 and a4 are the tricky parts but it's not too tricky right because we can establish ratios this is three right so if we were just to isolate these two triangles what do you notice about them about the base Wait, what you notice here is that the base of these two triangles establish a ratio of 1 to 3. If the ratios of the bases are 1 to 3, then the altitudes, right, must also be 1 to 3. Why is that? Well, let's call this altitude H1, let's call this H2. H1 plus H2, right, obviously is equal to 4. But we also know that the base establishes a ratio of 1 to 3. So therefore, H1 is only one third. So H1 is only one third as high as h2 is high right and that makes sense because remember if i were to have triangles where one of the side lengths establish a ratio with the other triangle right like this side and this side then obviously all other sides all share that same rate relationship so therefore if the base of this over the base of this is one to three then the altitude of this over the altitude of this is also one to three and you get it right here right because h1 if i rearrange it over h2 is also one to three so if that were to be the case, we can substitute this into this equation to get what? We get 4 over 3 h2 is equal to 4. So what is h2? h2 is equal to 4 times 3 over 4, which means the height of this is equal to 3. So if I scroll up, what we know here now is that this altitude is equal to 3. If that's 3, then obviously this altitude is 1. So now we solve the entire question. What is the area of the rectangle? The area of the rectangle is, uh, is 3 times 4, which is 12. 12 minus 4 plus the, the area of a3. Well, the area of A3 is equal to the base of 1 times the height of 1 divided by 2, which is equal to 1 over 2. So plus 0 0.5, and we plus this with A4. A4 is base of 3 times the height of 3 divided by 2, which is 9 over 2, which is 4.5. 4.5 plus 0.5 is 5, plus 4 is 9, which is equal to 3. Therefore, your final answer would be choice C.